So here's the uh, quick way to check the function of your Eberspacher BN4 or BA6 glow slash spark plug. What we're going to do is a quick continuity check. So don't mind the clutter here. Here's We're checking for continuity. If you look over here at the meter, you'll notice the continuity when it's touched together. See how the needle moves? Okay, that's what we want to see when we touch the end of the spark plug with the tip of the spark plug. We want to see that, that that needle moves. If it does not move, the spark plug is bad. So we connect it on one end, we connect it on the other. Nothing's moving on the meter. No bueno. The spark plug right here in my hand is bad. So we switch to this spark plug, clip on the end, Touch the end, notice the meter moving. Shrink. We have continuity, means that this has uh, got a clear path and that this is a good spark plug portion of this. The other thing to check is to see if the uh, glow plug works. So, take the meter stuff away. And I have a 12 volt battery hooked up here, as you can see, in my tester battery. Um, this is actually the power lead in. Sometimes there's two tabs on here, like this kind be very careful in that you see the one that has a, a bent angle to it that's the power side the ones that have two tabs on it this is a this is a grounding portion of this so if you hook power onto this your gas heater is not going to run it's going to start making funny noises ask me how i know sometime because it's very easy to do when you're getting in a rush and you're just gonna oh i gotta plug the power into the to the spark plug side so the glow plug works and you screw up and you, and you connect it into that negative portion real easy test just add power to the uh, power spade and then touch the plug body and it should heat up. Hopefully we'll be able to see it glow. There it goes. Starting to get red, cherry hot. I don't know if you can see it in the video. It's also smoking all the garbage off that's inside of it. There it is. Sucker's working. All right, right there, that's how you simply test your spark slash glow plug for function. This is a good one. This is one that's gonna go into my BA6 that I'm trying to get running in my panel, because I know this works. And one thing I found out today was that the plug that was in it did not work. So be very careful which plugs you use and, and thinking they work and when they don't, because that's probably one of the number one reasons why your gas heater doesn't start or when it does start, it blows a bunch of smoke because the glow plug is igniting it and not the spark plug. So it's filling up with gas. The gas is uh, just sitting there not being ignited. Then all of a sudden it does ignite because the glow plug will ignite it like the older style heaters. And poof, all this smoke and carbon and junk come out of your heater. So if you don't have a good plug, a good spark, it's not going to work.